another video on my YouTube channel, page, whatever I want to call this. Um, today, I'm going to show you guys how to dye this human shirt black wig. My natural hair color is black. God made me black hair. But, like, sometimes black is boring and I love dyeing my hair, as you can tell. My hair is always changing every other season. So, I'm going to show you guys how to dye this black wig. So, what you need is gloves, a brush, then a mixing bowl, foil developer, foil developer, a toner, dye, bleach, some more bleach, and a little wig, of course. And then you need a booster if you want. First, put the gloves on. So I'm gonna use this one first. Round one. If I stop using a brush for some reason, don't get mad at me. I dye my hair with my hand, not with brushes anymore. A little longer than a few minutes later. So I just rinsed out the bleach and now I'm gonna bleach again. I'm gonna use a quick blue. Round two. A few moments later. So this is how the wig looks after the second time of bleaching. Round three. A few moments later
one tone and three bleaches. twice because I got black hair same as the wig and then probably put like a protein packet on my hair for an hour or two and I go straight into a semi permanent dye and I put a protein packet again on my hair and then I do a protective hairstyle I leave my hair alone for two weeks or a week and a half and another protein packet and after that I'll wear my hair natural as in a like wash and go take care of my hair before I wear it out I don't recommend bleaching more than twice, uh, but for wigs it doesn't matter because it's not your own hair, you know, but for you guys, bleach your hair twice and if it's still not working out, it's not like anything you should do, then I keep working protein packets the entire rest of the day and leave your hair alone for, for two weeks and then go try to do the bleach process again. Because bleach is a very harsh chemical in your hair and it does strip your hair away, uh, but if you take care of it, and and you love it, then again that moisturization back and all that stuff that you lost when bleaching your hair. So this is how it came out. I wanted to look like an afro almost, like that pick it afro thing, because I always thought those were cute on short hair. So in the light, it really is pretty. As you can see. I'm gonna quick like lay it back down the way I wanted to because this hair was not damaged at all. But I think it's cute like this, like a little afro. So but it came out nice. I I like it. Came out exactly the way that I wanted to look. And like in more sunlight and lighty and then it's like it's more pretty. It's more pretty. See? So this is my video. I hope you enjoy it. And please subscribe, comment below, give me more ideas, you know. This is this is a thing now, so so let me know what you want from me and I'll see what I can do, you know? I, I'll see what I can do. I can see what I can help you with. But subscribe, come below, show the people you know I think that they want to dye their hair.